Superfood Evolution presents Cranberries. Are they a superfruit for urinary tract infections? How to use for nutraceutical purposes? Cranberries are rounded, glossy pale to deep red berries, most famous for their use in cranberry sauce, served during the holiday season, particularly at Thanksgiving in the US and Canada. Fresh cranberry harvests, in fact, often line up with this time of year, extending into late fall. Wild cranberries, a common food source consumed by many native North American communities, were most likely served at the first Thanksgiving dinner, an event that took place in prime New England cranberry growing regions. What are cranberries? The wild cranberry is a plant indigenous to cooler locations of the northern hemisphere. The name cranberry is reported to come from the English name craneberry, as the fruit's flower was thought to bear resemblance to the bill, neck, and head of a crane, a bird often found in cranberry marsh-like habitats. Wild cranberries grow on evergreen vines in water-soaked bogs, a type of acidic wetland that accumulates peat moss and is often layered with sand, clay, and gravel. They are in the same family as other berries, such as bilberry, huckleberry, and the common blueberry. There are two main species of cranberry, Vaccinium oxycoccus and Vaccinium macrocarpin. Vaccinium oxycoccus is a smaller type of berry, often considered to be a European variety. It's cultivated in many parts of Central and Northern Europe. Vaccinium macrocarpin, or large cranberry, is the Northern US and Canadian species, and the main one grown commercially. Currently, the world's top leading producer of cultivated berries is Wisconsin, while Quebec dominates the organic market. The wild Vaccinium macrocarpin variety was first cultivated in the 1800s in Cape Cod, Massachusetts. Since this time, many cultivars have been developed and are grown in human-made ponds referred to as cranberry bogs. Cranberries do not grow in the water, contrary to popular belief, but their cultivated beds can be flooded above the vines. This is usually done so the berries will float, enabling them to be harvested and corralled out of the pond. Fresh cranberries have a firm, crisp, slightly juicy texture, but are not as fleshy as other fruits because they have air pockets that give them a lighter weight. Cutting the berry in half reveals four hollow sections that contain small seeds. The seeds are sometimes extracted and sold as cranberry seed oil for topical and internal use due to their high vitamin E and omega-3 content. While the cranberry is edible as fresh raw fruit, its sour tart taste can dominate its sweet qualities. It is therefore frequently used with sweeteners in recipes. Dried fruits are likewise infused with cane sugar or apple juice to make them more palatable. The health benefits of cranberries in modern times are often utilized as a superfruit variety for their array of nutritional nourishment. For such purposes, they are frequently consumed in two different ways. Nutraceutical Ways to Use Cranberries Number 1. Cranberry Juice Fresh or frozen organic cranberries can be used to make pure, straight cranberry juice. Homemade varieties are one of the best ways to ensure quality, in our opinion. Secondary alternatives may include unsweetened cranberry juice that contains no additional ingredients and is made from fresh, pressed juice. The next best would be cranberry juice concentrate, which can be less potent. Number two, cranberry supplements. Cranberry is also concentrated for supplemental use as capsules or loose powders. These are extracts made from either the whole fruit or the pure juice, with the quantity per serving listed on product labeling. Straight ground cranberry powders are likewise available from some suppliers. Alcohol extracts of tinctured cranberry can also be used as a dietary supplement. Benefits of Cranberries for Urinary Tract Infections Cranberries, and especially cranberry juice, have long been reputed to protect against urinary tract infections, or UTIs, 
particularly those caused by the Escherichia coli bacteria, which accounts for about 80 to 85% of the cases. Since women are more prone to recurrent UTIs, females may benefit the most from cranberry supplementation. This is only as a preventative approach, not for actually treating an infection issue once it is established. Consuming certain cranberry products is thought to simply reduce the risk of future infection. Supplemental use of cranberry juice and powders are proposed to basically inhibit certain strains of uropathogenic E. coli from colonizing the lower urinary tract. After E. coli enters the bladder, it can attach itself to the inner walls and form a biofilm resistant to natural immune responses. Consuming specific amounts of cranberry juice, or its equivalent, is thought to prevent this initial adhesion or sticking of these types of bacteria so they simply pass through the urine. Cranberry's effectiveness for such purposes, however, can be individual or case dependent. Also, keep in mind, it is always best to consult your healthcare professional for recommended antibiotic treatment if you suspect you have a UTI, which left untreated, can have serious health consequences. Potential Cranberry-Derived Compounds Responsible What are the precise cranberry-derived components at work to support a healthy urinary system? Cranberries and pure cranberry products are recognized as a superfruit variety mostly because of their high antioxidant ratio compared to other fruits and foods. This includes antioxidant polyphenols such as quercetin, ursolic acid, pionidin, cyanidin, benzoic acid, and flavanthriols like the one that cranberry is most well known for, A-type proanthocyanidins. Historically, the benefits of cranberries for UTIs were once speculated to come from the fruit's acids. But in earlier research, isolated A-type proanthocyanidins from cranberry were claimed to be the main compounds found to exhibit anti-adhesion activity. Cranberries are one of the highest food sources of proanthocyanidins, which accounts for their bitter, astringent taste. A-type proanthocyanidins, or condensed tannins, are concentrated in cranberries likely due to their growing conditions which favor acidic, tannin-rich growing mediums. Interestingly, the biological function of proanthocyanidins is to defend the plant against harmful microbes. Cranberry juice and supplement products claims for UTIs. There are still conflicting conclusions in studies about the protective effect of cranberry use for UTIs. However, as of July 2020, the US FDA announced that it will not object to certain wording-specific qualified health claims regarding supplemental use of cranberry juice and cranberry fruit powder for their potential benefits at decreasing UTI risk for healthy women. Guidelines do not include cranberry sauce or dried fruit, but are exclusive to commercial cranberry juice beverages containing at least 27% pure juice and cranberry dietary supplements that have at least 500 milligrams of fruit powder. Claims must also specify that there is limited and inconsistent scientific evidence. Suggested daily quantities include, for juice, one 8 ounce serving per day, and for dietary supplements, one 500 milligram serving per day. Cranberries are high in other antioxidants like vitamin C and are also a source of D mannose. D-mannose is a type of sugar present in cranberries that is known to be helpful for UTIs, although scientific research remains inconclusive. D-mannose is available as an isolated supplement, which is often combined with cranberry extracts for their nourishing components. Note: Cranberries grown for commercial production are commonly sprayed with heavy amounts of pesticides due to bog-like growing conditions that are vulnerable to insects. It is best to purchase organic cranberries or organic cranberry juice or supplements if you use them on a frequent basis. Precautions It is best to avoid cranberries or cranberry products if you are sensitive to high acid foods or oxalates. Consult your medical professional before consuming cranberry products on a regular basis if you are pregnant, nursing, taking prescribed medications, have recurring UTIs, or if you have other serious medical conditions.
Thanks for watching. For additional in-depth info, as well as the best sources of medicinal cranberry products we know of, be sure and investigate the links in the description box below this video. Please support us by giving this video a thumbs up if you found it useful. And be sure and check out these other informational videos.